in the Restless fans. Hopefully you're having a wonderful holiday weekend. We're closing out one year, headed into a new one. And guess what? We got some new spoilers to talk about. So let's get to it. First, we see Sharon confronting Summer about feelings for Chance. Victoria shocks everyone with a decision and Chance make a confession to Sharon. Welcome back to CBS Soap Dish Recap, where we recap everything CBS Soaps, both the young and the restless and the bold and the beautiful. This is your young and the restless full spoilers for the week of January 1st through January 5th, 2024. And without any further ado, let's talk about what's going on at this first week in Genoa City. So we start out Magnificent Monday. Also, Happy New Year, January 1st. Not with a new episode, a replay from October 17, 2023, where it's going to focus on the fallout of the fire at Gina's and Kevin covering his tracks with his girlfriend, Lily. It also features Sharon getting grilled by Nick, while Brad and JT are frantic to find Colleen. Now move into to terrific taco tuesday the second day of the new year january 2nd as victor brokers a truce between nick and adam now here's the thing you would think after everything nick has gone through this past month with aunt jordan he shouldn't even be thinking about being angry with adam but of course sally and adam are getting closer and closer and nicholas is not happy about it he is still thinking that his brother is the enemy uh no nicholas aunt jordan was your enemy but i guess you forgot about that but anyway look like victor is trying to patch things up with his sons once again and i gotta say i picked a perfect picture for this particular spoiler because you can look at victor's faces like here we go again. I don't even know why you try, Victor, but hey, it makes for good soap drama. Also on Tuesday, Victoria, another Newman. She is going to shock everyone with a decision. And I mean, I know we got Hope's decision that's supposed to shock us on the bold and the beautiful. Well, look like on the young and the restless, Victoria is going to shock everyone with her decision. Is she stepping away from Newman to figure out this relationship with her newly found daughter, Claire? Or could it be something else? We got to stay tuned. Still on Tuesday, we have this other vague spoiler where Nikki is taking matters into her own hands. This could be anything. Could it be her taking matters into her own hands with her drinking? Will she maybe go and see Aunt Jordan in prison and have her say, which, you know, I don't know what matters she could take in her own hands with Jordan at this point. She already didn't put her behind bars. Or is this have something to do with Claire and building a new relationship? Because, hey, according to Nikki, nobody's going to bother Claire ever again since she saved her life. So, so it's going to be very interesting to see the actual details of this particular spoiler. So, hey, we got to stay tuned. Now we move into wonderful hump day Wednesday, January 3rd, as Sharon and Summer have a bit of a confrontation about Sharon's feelings for chance. Now, if you saw that Thursday preview for this upcoming week, because we didn't have a new episode this past Friday the 29th, it looks like we got Summer confronting Sharon about whether or not she's in love with Chance, because we all know Summer want to get her claws into the handsome Chance Chancellor, and we want to see that too. I think they're a better match than him and Sharon. So yeah, it's going to be interesting to see what she has to say, but there's more to talk about with that whole Sharon Chance dynamic. We got a few more spoilers to go. Also on Wednesday, look like somebody else need to have a conversation. And it's Daniel and Heather as they get to clear the air. She fell asleep on him, supposedly on New Year's Eve. Of course, we know Lucy took that picture. And we know she probably going to post that to social media. So there's going to be a little bit of fallout about that probably later. At the same time, they kissed each other too. 
and looked like uh, Daniel didn't pull away. So they got to figure that out because Lily will be back soon. And I'm hoping she can see whatever Lucy posted. But look like Danny has because rounding up on Wednesday, Danny offers unsolicited advice to Daniel. And as we saw in that Thursday preview for this upcoming week, he must have saw what maybe Lucy put on social media, that picture of Heather sleeping on Daniel. So, yeah, it's going to be a little bit of fall out but we gotta watch now we move into friday eve a terrific thursday january 4th as nikki is battling the temptation to drink and we saw in the last thursday preview for this upcoming week it looked like of course victor is by his wife's side he's not going anywhere she's the love of his life so it looked like he's going to be there to help her through this drinking struggle so remember i said earlier in this video that there were more spoilers to come regarding chance and Sharon yep also on Thursday chance make a confession to Sharon now I'm wondering did he feel the vibes that Summer felt when they went to that concert together they're probably a better fit and have a lot more in common I mean right now Sharon is busy trying to set up a company he's starting a new job I think we haven't seen him over at Chancellor that much yet but hey Jill recruited him over there and she has been busy 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 which is why summer had a leeway to get in to go to that concert and we know sharon knows she went so yeah this is going to be interesting i'm hoping chan said hey you know what sharon things have been really cool with us but you know what i don't think this is going to work out you know i kind of want to explore other options so yeah we got to see what he has to say Rounding up Thursday, we got Victoria working on her relationship with Claire as she missed out on 25, almost 26 years of Claire's life. That was back in 1998 when we had Heather Tom as Victoria and we had Cole together and baby Eve was presumably gone. So yeah, she got some time to, you know, make up for, get to know about. And you know what? I'm interested to see what the dynamics is going to happen happen between mom and daughter you know what Claire you got a couple siblings too when it comes to Johnny and Katie so I'm curious to see if they kind of blend that dynamic in later down the road and finally TGIF Fantastic Friday January 5th and we got more Sharon and Chance drama it looks like Sharon is going to make a decision about her future drawing on her past experiences and we know what her past experiences have been when it comes to men so she's probably like you know what I see the writing on the wall I don't want to have to fight against Phyllis's daughter who I used to have to fight with Phyllis over Nicholas and Jack and everybody else so why would I have to fight her daughter you know what maybe I need to move myself out of this equation so maybe she makes that type of decision I don't think it's about business it could be but you know what Sharon hey it would be mature to say you know what I don't think this is going to work and I don't really want to have to do this fight with Summer yeah, so it's going to be interesting. So we got to stay tuned for this and everything else coming up this first week on The Young and the Restless this new year. Okay, so there you have it. Look like some interesting storylines that we got just to kick off the new year on The Young and the Restless. I'm here for it. I'm looking for you. Probably a Valentine's romance when it comes to summer and chance. So yeah, we got to stay tuned. Also, if you haven't checked out the full spoilers for The Bold and the Beautiful, they have been uploaded to the channel. And until the next video, like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you next time. Bye.